My name is Chef Ken and welcome to dinner at our house. Tonight we are going to make some tilapia pan fried, we are going to make some beautiful peach salsa, and we are going to make a garlic cream sauce to go on the fish with some rice. And so we're going to get started. Let me show you how it's done. Alright, so here we go. We're going to assemble this salsa. It's quick, it's easy, it's yummy. and let's medium sized Roma tomato, half of a white peach, a whole jalapeno just seeded and finely diced, quarter of a cucumber, quarter of a red onion, tablespoon of green onion, small bunch of, of coarsely chopped cilantro, that teaspoon of vinegar, tablespoon, sorry, of, of rice wine vinegar, and um, about a teaspoon of canola oil. Okay, we're gonna put in a tablespoon of garlic. A tablespoon of sugar, we're going to mix that all up and get the colors all going through them pretty. We're going to take half of a lime and we're going to deduce all the lime out of there into this salsa. Make sure we get all the pulp and everything. Mix it up. Start from this. All right, now what we're gonna do is just mix this up really good, put it in the fridge and let it sit for the rest of the few minutes while we make the rest of the food so that all the flavors will gather together. Next we're gonna bread the tilapia we have three beautiful fillets of tilapia right here. Okay, and what we're gonna do is we got a breading station right here, and I'm gonna whip these eggs up right here like this. And then I'm gonna add my milk into the eggs so that it gives the eggs not as thick. Okay, and now we have a breading station. So what we're gonna do here is, we're gonna take a piece of tilapia, we're gonna put a little salt and pepper on both sides of it. Okay, first we're gonna go to the flour and we're gonna bread the one side. Okay, so we're gonna go down into the flour. Okay, shake it off. We're gonna go into the egg wash. Then we're gonna come down to here, drop it into the breading. Okay, just the one side, and then we have a bread piece of fish. Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna come over. Okay, then we're gonna hit the egg wash. Breading. Okay, there's our three fillets. Okay, now we're gonna come over here and we're gonna do this steak. These are tri-tip steaks. And you wanna pick out some nice looking yummy ones here. And what you're looking for is the marmalization in the meat. All this little bits of fat that come through the meat bring out flavor and they bring out, you know, tenderness in the meat. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna put some salt and pepper on those. One's for the kids, so we'll give the kids this one, and then we're gonna take some red chili powder and we're gonna put all over this other one right here. Okay, turn it over, put some more red chili powder on it, spread it on there nice and yummy. All right, so we've got red chili powder on one and we have salt and pepper on the other. We're just gonna let those sit there. Okay, and we're gonna sear this, this tri-tip really good on both sides of the meat, okay? So while we're doing that, we're gonna heat up this pan over here for our fish. And we're gonna go ahead and put about 
most of the oil in the bottom there. You want to coat the whole pan bottom with oil. All right, well, while we got this meat cooking in the thing here, we're going to start working on our sauce. It's going to be a garlic cream sauce. We want a little bit of lime in there, a little bit of sour flavor. We're going to put a little bit of garlic in there and some cream, and we're going to reduce it. So over here, we're going to take this other half of the lime we have, and we're just going to cut two little thin slices on it. And that's going to be our garnish for our fish, okay? All right, so we got the two little slices for garnish, and then we're going to take the rest of this lime and add it to our cream sauce. So just a little bit, just a little couple of drops will work. And we're going to add our garlic. The rest of the garlic from the other recipe. And we're going to slowly let that start cooking in a little bit of a tiny bit of oil that we put in there. And we're just going to set it down into this, this oil right here. Tilapia. Turn that over now. We got a good sear on one side. See, we're gonna turn it over. And we got a beautiful sear on the middle side of that steak. We'll get another good sear on that and then we'll finish it in the oven. The garlic's nice and warm. You can see that the oils are bouncing around it. We're gonna add our whole cup of cream to that. Okay. We're gonna take the rest of this lime here. Since we're only making a little bit of sauce here, we're just gonna drizzle that lime right into there to give it a nice lime flavor, nice sour flavor, and we're going to let that reduce. I'm going to put a little salt and pepper in it real quick. Okay. Alright, we'll come check our fish, see if we got a nice golden brown on the other side. Yes, we do. It's looking very beautiful. Let's take that golden brown fish over there like that. We're just going to pop it right into our oven. All right, now we'll take the two steaks that we've seared on both sides, and we're just going to finish them off in the oven with the fish. All right, so we got the steak and the fish in the oven. They're finishing off and everything. And right here on the stove, we got our beautiful sauce, which is bubbling up and reducing so that we can get a nice flavor going there. All right, we've got our rice here. We've put some butter, we put some garlic in there, some salt, pepper, and some mazithra cheese and it just has made, it makes it really rich rice and we put some in the middle of the plate here, okay? We're gonna grab uh, some of our fish right here that we've just pan cooked right here. We're gonna set it on, and we're just gonna set it right here on top like that, okay? We're gonna put it over the glass, which is just gonna go right around the bottom here a little bit. Okay. Put a lime on top for looks here. All right, well check this out, man. We got this beautiful meal looking right here, and I'm gonna see if it tastes any good. And if it kills me on film, you don't have to make it. But here we go, I'm gonna take a big old swoop of the tilapia, I'm gonna put some of that sauce on there, get some of this rice, some of this salsa in there, man. I'm gonna make sure I got all the flavors going. Mmm. Mm. The salsa cuts right into that rich sauce. It's so good if you do at home and try to make this. Ciao, and we'll talk to you next time.